you know, I, I meet a lot of young groups, and I say, I can't read music or write it. They go, what? <laughs> and it's like, well, that doesn't work. Well, if you've done this, how could you do it without? But it means that it's here. It's not on a bit of paper. I tell kids who want to learn the piano, I say, OK, here's you go. Start with middle C. We all know that as the first thing in a piano lesson. And then think about, like, the Eddie Cochran thing. You say, well, that's, that's a chord, if you play those together. And you just got that, remember this and that. So you do with that, one space, finger, one space, finger. So there you got the chord. I say, you know, we started there. Mm -hmm. And so you could kind of write a song with that. Yeah, yeah. But if you just move this up one, it's the same shape. Yeah. You've got another chord. Yeah, so now you've got two chords. You move three. it up again, you've got three chords. Yeah. And move it up again, you've got four yeah, chords. Yeah. And then again, you've got five. And then now you've got six. Well, you don't need more than that. Yeah. So you can now put permutations yeah. of that. And you get songs, you know, going... Same little shape. Yeah. But that shape is a marvelous shape. <laughs> you can do anything with that shape. You know. Did your dad teach you that shape? No, we figured that out from. We had to know this to do Jerry Lee Lewis. Yeah. Come on, babe. Hold on, shake, move on. So it's really gets super fascinating, I think. Absolutely. You know, the, you, you've got all the chords you can play with, put those in permutations, then mess with the bass notes. The obvious thing to do is to do the, the note one octave down that relates to that chord. Or, but you can do... Harmony. And you, you're getting really dramatic now. And I think that's all we ever did, you know, just experimented. Um, but John doing it, imagine, you can hear that's him. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Yeah. It's just sort of what we'd learned based on that. Yeah. I saw John Legend the other night, and John's doing this. I forget what the song was. And then he sort of goes. But that's those, that's those. Yeah. If you put some nice soul stuff over that. I've got a pain in it. I've got my pain in my heart. You know, yeah. da, 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 love. Our favorite composer was Bach mm. in the Beatles because it was nearest to what we were doing. Mm. And we always used to say, just put a beat behind it. Yeah. It'd be better. Yeah. <laughs> It'd be better, man. Yeah. What I liked about it was the mathematical thing, so that you kind of go, well, in Eleanor Rigby. You do that, so you got one, two, three, four, and then you found out this is what they were doing. One, two, and then, uh, you know, so you put those together, and then on top of it, you might put, So you've got like, you know, two or four yeah. or eight. Yeah. It's very In simple the same mathematics. Space. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's all happening together, so it gives this lovely feel of something satisfying. <laughs>